Now, some people have said to me that they don't like to leave this much wasted space on the side of the pad. So what I would then do is I would take, because these holes are equidistant, I would move, so remember it was here, I would put this hole here and I would align the holes And what that does is it allows me to continue that line across. And obviously you can do that for the other side. So that gives you lines edge to edge. Now I'm going to flip the pad over. So as you can see I'm using two pads here. And I'm going to put this on the back side of the pad because it's high enough. And from there, I can turn this and line up to those cuts. And you can see it's extended it all the way up to the edge of the page. So because you can do this and that, it means you can also expand this up to a much larger sheet. So if you're ruling up, you know, like a really big sheet of paper, you can actually just pin that in place on the top line and move it across and essentially tessellate or tile up the pattern.